This is what we do. This is what we do. Radioactive! Radioactive! Well, good afternoon on this Thursday. I'm enjoying a nice cup of coffee black. It's much needed this afternoon. Going through my client roster, doing some house cleaning, seeing who needs to assess next. We do check uh, assessments every four weeks to make sure we're on target, we're reaching our goals. And sadly, this is a huge stack of clients that are no longer training with me. So, got to do some house cleaning and throw out the trash. These are people that came up short. These are people that, that well, they quit. Uh, to put it simply, they uh, gave up on themselves, they gave up on me, and, uh, well, a lot of them were going at half-ass, so what are they going to get? They're going to get half-ass out of life. They will not transform. It didn't work out. Sadly, a lot of clients do come and go, and they waste my time. Uh, so, uh, where does this pile end up? Well, we make room now for new clients, and uh, new beginnings, a new chapter. These people sadly end up in my trash can. Hey guys, it's about that time. Get ready for a workout, a pull workout, aka back workout. I'm also going to hit biceps and I'm just getting my alpha aminos ready. I get a lot of questions about what I'm drinking during my workout, and that's my branch chain amino acids, my BCAAs. Uh, this is Cellicor, alpha aminos. This flavor is uh, fruit punch. I'll mix it up from time to time. But basically, your aminos are your body's building blocks. and uh, for optimal health and performance and just keeping you overall healthy you want to get your aminos in your body requires there's a not there's not essential aminos and there's essential amino acids and some of which your body produces naturally others we need to get from our food source and that can be hard to do and so like most things that's why we supplement i like to drink my aminos during my workout because that's the time i'm creating a stressful environment and whatever comes in my body's going to quickly absorb um, so same thing same reason why you have your protein shake post-workout um, because your, your muscles are screaming for it, your body is uh, depleted and whatever you feed your body during that time, your body's going to quickly absorb. So that is uh, pretty much the same concept. I like to drink it during my workout. You can drink it any time of the day. This is a good product. Uh, I like Cellular Core, good profile. Uh, comes There's a hydration formula in here and it, it really all of your essential amino acids for you know muscle recovery and, and muscle building and uh, performance I mean you're covered here so I'm going to uh, get that going and uh, there, you, there you have it you know if you're not uh, I like to make sure that I am covering the bases and I like to uh, especially when I'm cutting because I'm in a, I'm in a deficit I'm in a calorie deficit and so I, I like to make sure that I'm getting my aminos in when I'm cutting but I all year round whether I'm bulking or cutting I like to supplement with my aminos during my workout and uh, just make sure that I'm uh, getting those building blocks in. Well, time for my workout. Well, friends, officially I'm done with my workout. Hit my cardio, hit my pool workout. I was all ready to leave the gym. Noticed it was raining really bad. Didn't feel like getting wet, run into my truck. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna go back into the cardio room and I'm gonna jump on the bike. So here I am. Session two of cardio. Well, hello, friends. Good morning. It is day 26 of my mini cut, and it is a Friday, and I'm excited for the weekend, gearing up for the weekend, because it's my wife's birthday tomorrow, and it actually falls on a Saturday, unlike my birthday that fell on a Monday. There's not much we could we could have done, but uh, I'm looking forward to it. It's been a birthday house uh, at my house because my daughter's birthday kind of kicked things off. Then a few weeks a few weeks later, it's my birthday, and then a few weeks after that, it's my wife's birthday. So. Um, my, my parents are going to watch our daughter and we're going to go up to Naples and we're going to just beach bum it. We went up there during the summer for a family vacation. We kind of rented a property during the summer and we loved it. It was just uh, a nice little town and the beaches on the west coast I prefer than the east coast. Oh my god, just overlooking the Gulf of Mexico. It was just amazing. It was really, really nice. So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to beach bum it and enjoy each other's company. So it's going to be a grown uh, adult weekend which is nice, you know, just some time away, just the two of us like it used to be. It can get crazy with the kid, you know, so it, it, that's important. So I'm looking forward to that, and then Sunday we'll cut a cake with family and, you know, sing happy birthday and all that good stuff. So I am looking forward to uh, the weekend. Hello, friends. I just came home from a full morning of training clients, and I'm hungry because it's mealtime. 
I eat within the first hour of waking up and then I eat every two to three hours and I close out the day with four, five, sometimes six meals a day. Hitting my hydration goals too. Don't know if you can see that. We're at the halfway mark. A gallon a day and we're at the halfway mark. We're going to get it in. It's about 1.30 p.m. on this Friday. Getting closer and closer to the weekend. But right now, it's time to feed the body. And I'm going to make one of my uh, signature uh, meals. Um, I'm thinking eggs. I'm thinking my badass egg omelet with some Ezekiel toast on the side topped with hummus. Maybe uh, if we have some avocados, i got to check. Put some avocados on top too. Delicious. So that's what we're going to do. Well, there you have it. Egg omelet topped with tomatoes and avocado. Ezekiel toast topped with hummus. I'm going to enjoy this, friends. Yes, I am. You know what's really cool about what I do? Sometimes I feel like a superhero. My clients count on me. I gotta be there. I gotta show up. I gotta be consistent. I gotta hold them accountable. And I can't let them down. They're counting on me. And that makes me feel good. And it can be stressful at times too, but I like to think that I'm kind of like this fitness superhero. Big training session in session right now. Chris and Melanie. Ow! Where's Melanie? There she is. Chris and Melanie doing the damn thing. It's nothing. Glove it's drills, nothing. ladies and gentlemen, glove drills. It's nothing. It's cake. Grandma's workout, that's what they call it. Barn fist. This is what we do. They've been consistent. They started with me a few weeks back. Three days a week. Three days a week. Less than 30 seconds remaining. How do you feel? How do you feel? Awesome. Great. This is what we do. This is what we do. Well, it's been a long day. It's currently 9.04 p.m. I am finally home, parked in my driveway. I am going to go in and get something to eat. I uh, just finished training Chris and Melanie, which you saw. Great couple. They've been working extremely hard the last few weeks. Uh, we haven't missed a session since we got started. Training consistently three days a week. We implemented their meal plan this week. So they're five days in on their meal plan, and they're just crushing it. They are meal prepping, getting their meals in. They're training at their max uh, during their training sessions. They're just doing everything right. If they stay focused and they continue to work hard, this couple will make a total body transformation. And what's really motivating about Chris is he's going to the police academy in January. So uh, that's motivating. He wants to pass the physical, obviously, and um, be the top in his class and, and pass out uh, with flying colors. So and Melanie's right there at his side. She wants to make a total body transformation. They, they both want this and they're both working extremely hard. So thank you guys for giving me 110%. You make what I do exciting and worth it. So thank you. Well, the weekend's finally here, sort of. I got some light packing to do, so a few more things before I call it a night. And then tomorrow, the wifey and I, to celebrate her birthday, we're going to go to Naples, two hour drive towards the west coast uh, the florida west coast and we're gonna have a good time we're just gonna beach bum it and um the beaches up there are, are, are nice 
I prefer the Florida West Coast than I think the East Coast. We were there during the summer and it was just awesome. So you'll have to check out the next vlog to see what happened. We're going to have a good time. So again, thank you for watching my vlogs. If you watch them regularly and you're a subscriber, thank you so much. Leave a comment down below. Let me know that you're watching. Give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Check out the rest of my channel. Thank you so much for, uh, for watching and, um, Stay with me.